So in this video, I'm gonna review my trip on Singapore Airlines. All right, let's go fly. Well, she was super nice. She like made all the efforts to try to get us the seats we wanted. Oh, that's awesome. The toilets are so cool in Japan. Alright, we're about to get on the flight. Thank you. Oh, just one. Yeah. This way on the right. Thank you. Hello. Smooth check-in and the cabin attendants were super pleasant. They showed me some love by handing out wet towels and walked around offering drinks throughout the entire flight. They kept asking me for refills. Now that's what I call service. Cabin space. The pitch on these economy seats are fairly standard, but nonetheless, it still felt kind of tight like my clothes after an all-you-can-eat yakiniku night. Aside from that, I love everything else about the cabin space, like the seat pockets, folding table with a dope mirror, snazzy footrest, a contouring headrest, and a decent reclining seat. Wow, just sitting down, I'm already amazed by all of the facilities they have here. They even have USB chargers. Oh wow, and they even have a hangar. They have awesome television set and this controller for the screen. It almost looks like a PCP controller. PCP. I mean PSP. PCP is a drug. Stay away from drugs, kids. And the movies here are amazing. They got really, really cool selection of movies. So cool. And the in-flight headphones are pretty impressive. Instead of your standard headphones, they offer earbuds and with three sets to fit all sizes. And if that's not enough for you audio files, you can plug in your own headphones just like BAM! This is pretty cool. They have some really awesome stuff. I like the fact that they have toothbrushes and they have combs and they have like all these like amenities for you just to like feel a little bit more comfortable when you're flying with Singapore. But for personal amenities, it's pretty standard. So I give it a, you can do better next time, three. Singapore Air, where are my slippers at? Meal, check it out. I thought I'd get one bag of nuts, but I actually got two bags. That's nuts. Another excellent point about Singapore Air is that even economy class gets a menu book in English and in Japanese. And if the meals don't fill your tummy, you can order additional snacks, sandwiches, and drinks throughout the entire flight. This is the Western meal. It has a giant hamburger steak, seafood salad, and not so warm dinner roll. It's actually bigger than I expected. It's pretty big. Look at that. Pretty hefty. Mm. It's pretty moist, but I don't really like the sauce so much. It has like this uh, medicinal aftertaste. Not my favorite. And this is a Japanese meal. Yakitori, somen noodles, and appetizers. Oh, and I forgot to record the haagen ice cream at the end of the meal. Mmm, that's pretty good. Some wasabi in here. Like hearty. Yeah. I like how there's all these toppings that you get to put in the sauce. The noodles are kind of hard. The sauce is pretty good, but the noodles could be a little bit better. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So if you guys like this video, help me out and hit that like button. If you have any questions or comments about the ride, leave a comment in the comment section below. And like always, if you want to see more of my adventures in Tokyo, Japan, and all over the world, hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys in the next one.